Our last and final assignment is Candace Doe investigation. I want you to create a new case in autopsy and add the corresponding file uh, data source, uh, which is uh, located uh, inside this uh, zip file. Just download it and add it as a data source. Uh, uh, based on the case brief uh, that you should read carefully. Decide which of autopsy and just modules you want to execute and carefully examine the results uh, of the module processing and start searching for evidence according to the case information that uh, you have in your case brief. As usual, uh, you can uh, specify what is the summary information that you have about the case, uh, what you consider to be your objectives. And then, uh, of course, as usual, we start with information about the e image file that we're going to examine, uh, provide uh, the results of uh, hash verification, uh, briefly describe what you know about the file system found uh, on the data source media, uh, as usual, uh, keep track of all the steps that you execute in your investigation. Where do you start? What do you do next? How do you uh, search for various types of evidence? Just uh, keep, uh, this is like your journal. You are just keep, keep note of every step that you make. And uh, uh, detailed steps are needed to be able to reproduce these steps in case if you have to uh, demonstrate uh, your skills and what you did in the later testimony or in general if you want to share your knowledge about the case uh, with colleagues and your teammates. The typical uh, section in your report will be also um, the forensic tools that you use, of course including the versions of the software and uh, any other detail information you'd like to include in this section. So in general, describe uh, steps taken to investigate the contents of the image. It's mostly this is initial, um, initial stages of your investigation. You can mention uh, the set of uh, ingest modules that you processed and uh, what do you believe are the reasons why you are executing these ingest modules. As you begin to find evidence, uh, keep track of the files. You can specify locations, you can specify the starting sectors um, of your files, uh, or just at, at a minimum, just keep a list of uh, files that uh, you consider to be uh, potential important uh, findings in this case. If you decide to extract the information and look at uh, uh, the relevant information uh, in external software, make sure that once again you mention the software that you're using and uh, describe in general your activities outside of autopsy, if that's your case. Uh, then uh, write the conclusion objectively uh, regarding all of your findings and whether you uh, again consider to be some somebody to be a victim and uh, anything important that you can specify in this summary. So yes, mention the victims if you find any uh, evidence of victims and uh, also mention anything specific about the case. So consider this is our final project, uh, so you can uh, save your changes periodically and submit for grading when uh, your investigation is complete.